Now we're back on the Inside Scoop, and I'm talking with Mark Mapes. Hello, Mr. Mapes. Hi. Uh, first off, I want to get into asking you about a couple of your horses that you've got in tonight. But first, uh, where are you stabled at? How many have you got? And uh, how many hours a day do you spend uh, training, jogging, things like that? Um, well, right now we're down to four horses. Um, just, I need a few more, but my, my oldest kids are in 4-H and I do a lot of that in the summer, quarter horse racing or barrel racing and um, so it's just one of them times where I got them going on and then the four and you know we have a farm with about 20 cows and Angus beef so a little bit more of a hobby right now. So you got the entire agricultural experience happening at your farm. Oh, That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about a couple of uh, races in tonight. Uh, first off, let's look at number six. Uh, you've got the three hole with Mega Chips. He draws an inside post tonight. Uh, the program uh, pass line show interference uh, in, in the last uh, couple times out. What can you tell us about that? Um, well, he'd been, I've been grabbing on with him a lot and he had the seven hole and you never know what to do here I mean what kind of quarter they're going to go and if there's a hole there so I thought at the last second I'd try to leave which was the wrong thing to do because everybody left and then uh, surrounded he made a break in the turn there run out and I think we was four or five wide in that first turn and by the time we did get down there was no hole so he had to kind of go the tough mile there following I think Bart had one in there it was part two and he's kind of a, he's not the soundest horse in the winter, and I thought last week he was a little better. And that was one of the reasons I put Ronnie down to drive him this week. Okay. Plus, my cousin's in there, and I hate driving against him because yeah. family, you know, just one of the reasons. Family rivalry yeah. going on in there. Well, Let's uh, look at number nine, uh, race number nine, rather, number one, uh, Lightning Watt, another inside post. Uh, Again, in the past, shows an interference and a break. Uh, what can you tell us about that, and what do you think his uh, chances are tonight? He looks to be a bit of a long shot, but... Uh. He's, he's one I bought this winter. He's kind of a project horse, and you never want to do projects in the winter. But uh, he's... Last week, he got run into. You know, that was a green race, and sometimes these horses don't steer just exactly like you want them to, and I think Ronnie's horse broke a hobble or something and kind of run into him about knocked him down and he raced actually pretty good he come back a long ways and was right there for a check he's just stuck on sixth right now for me and i think he's a horse that could do good but he, he don't like sounds sounds kind of bothering okay. it's sight you know i had a fox run out and training him and then about run him over and didn't scare him at all but sounds, he hears anything. If he hears something, yeah. he might get So we've been working on plugging his ears good and everything, and hopefully we can control him a little bit because he's... So we'll see how that works out for you tonight. Yeah. That's it, all from the inside scoop for now, and we'll send it back upstairs, and we'll be back uh, in a bit. Thank you.